Hello. My name is Peter Koble, and I'm running for Forbes Library Trustee. I want to thank NCTV for inviting me to speak directly with you, the voters of Northampton. Let me begin by saying there's a great field of candidates running for the open trustee positions. It's a sign of how much our community loves and values Forbes. The race is important because the newly elected trustees will have an opportunity to shape the library for years to come. So it's a competitive race, and all the candidates are well qualified. But we all have different backgrounds and bring different things to the table. I'm a nonfiction author and a nonprofit communications writer. I've been deeply involved with the library for more than two years. During that time, I've served on the board of the Friends of Forbes Library. I'm also the editor of the library's newsletter and recently started a book club at the library devoted to nature and the environment. So what does the Friends group do? We're fundraisers, hosting the annual wine tasting and garden tour. We raise a substantial amount of money each year, which mostly goes to support the book and general media fund. We also help to fund the new elevator. But the Friends also support other library programs and initiatives. The library has specific needs. The director, Janet Molding, or the assistant director, Lisa Downing, will ask the Friends board for specifically targeted gifts. Friends recently funded major audiovisual upgrades in the Coolidge Museum and the community room. As board members, we must make tough decisions about how our funds are spent. Over the summer, Janet and Lisa informed us the library's outreach program, which delivers books to patrons who can't come to the library to get them, was in danger. And we moved quickly to find a way to save it. Fortunately, a number of folks in our community anonymously donated enough to keep it going for the next year. But I'm working on a special committee made up of a few trustees and a few friends to find ways to make the beloved program sustainable. The last friends meeting, I introduced a motion which passed overwhelmingly to fund a volunteer coordinator who will train people to deliver books. So I'm quite well aware of the library's needs. But I'm also aware of the many accomplishments made by Forbes' terrific staff. I want to make certain that the library continues to serve our community in the best possible way. As a trustee, I would hope to make an even greater contribution. I would be very grateful for your vote on November 3rd.